This is not financial advice, not legal advice for entertainment educational purposes only. And anything I say is my opinion. Please don't make any financial decision based on anything I say in these videos. That being said, hit the like button, subscribe button, all that YouTube album stuff so you get the videos I put them out. So you don't think and see them analyzing that data. But like I tell every day, the day they release us is false. I'm going to give us a false narrative of the market so we can make bad trading decisions. Listen, GME finished green yesterday. And I know a lot of people felt good about that. Me personally, it doesn't matter to me if, it, if, if, if the shares finish green, if it finish red, because I know it means absolutely nothing until these bad actors run out of money or the SEC, DOJ, FBI start enforcing the rules of the market. They will do whatever they want with the stock. The numbers they release to us are for Gazy because they control all the data. They control all the information that we receive when it comes to this stock market. OK, uh, as of yesterday, the, the volume, well, the alleged volume was two million three hundred and sixty six, eight hundred four hundred and fifty eight. Of course, they're still saying that the DRS share is forty eight point oh six percent. I believe that's absolutely crazy. There's no way that's the numbers, but that's just my opinion. Uh, the calls and the money is eight thousand seven hundred and ninety three. And if it hits twenty dollars, there'll be additional. 57,491 shares, I mean, calls that's in the money. Absolutely crazy. But you guys know that how I feel about that. The, sh the calls mean absolutely nothing because they they sell naked calls. They sell naked calls. You and I can't do that. Well, I don't know. I mean, some of you shills probably can. But most, a majority of retail investors cannot sell naked covered calls. If they sell a covered call, they need 100 shares in order to get in that game. That's really the bottom line. Um, we had two, 20 20.13 days to cover. Okay, 20.13 days to cover, according to Fintel. And there's 59,673 and 27 shares available to short. And this goes back to where did these shares come from? They, there's no chain of custody. There's no blue sheets. There's no point of origination because the, the shares don't really exist. This is one big Ponzi scheme and everybody is fully aware of what they're doing, but they're afraid that the market crashes. So they allow them to continue with the malfeasance. But I believe it's not even going to save them. I believe the market is going to go down anyway. Just my opinion. Anyway, 61.4% of the volume was shorted shares. So like 1,400,000 of the shares were shorted. And we know they're not real shares shorted. They're not real shares. They lend the same shares over and over again. Or they add to their, their shares sold, <laughs> not yet purchased position. And then they sell, then they send rather. The fair to deliver to Cayman Islands, Puerto Rico, Europe, Brazil, where whoever else will take them. So the DTCC does not have to think about them. Anyway, please leave some comments. Tell me what you think. Do you think that this is going to be the biggest financial crime in the history of the planet? Anyway, have a great day. God bless. And I appreciate y'all on this journey with me.